Um, Tom Brady has some interesting things to say about the state of the game and why he thinks young quarterbacks are succeeding, coming right in. And I largely agree with what he said. Now, he was asked about Patrick Mahomes. Everybody knows Patrick Mahomes has had a, a historic hot start, hot start to the uh, NFL season. Um, he had some really, great, some really, really good games. I believe he threw, what, six touchdowns in the game. And Mr. Bisky has recently done it too. But uh, Tom Brady said that it's a lot of, you know, young quarterbacks coming in today. And they're able to succeed right away because of the rule changes and you know because of the rules changes you uh, they can bring the um, college offense into the NFL and I remember when I was younger you know uh, they always say the college the college offense doesn't work in the NFL because of the NFL players are you know too fast too physical to this to that and now that you know the NFL has softened up uh, the defense and made it more towards uh, towards the offense giving the offense a more of an more of an advantage and you can't be physical with the receivers or physical with the quarterback anymore. Now you can run that spread option that, uh, that spread, uh, offense from college. You can bring it to the NFL. It's more like a seven on seven. And Tom Brady said, uh, we really don't know how good these guys really are because they, they didn't play in the era, which when I first came in the league, which Tom is correct, but Tom also, you know, benefited, from from the last what five six years of his career playing, you know under these same rules. But I understand what Tom Brady was saying was he was saying that uh, y'all are you know getting a little bit too ahead of y'all selves because the rules have changed so much. See that's why it's hard to to um, compare you know players from different eras because different eras have different rules, you know, and different eras play they play different. So it's hard to correlate who's better and who's the best way you can you, you can correlate who's better is who played under stiffer rules because the rules largely have a lot to, you know, play, ha have a lot to do with, you know, how you uh, create, how, how numbers are, uh, you know, created, how, um, you know, uh, wins are, are um, you know, um, how win totals come out and all that stuff. So when you say, when you go to a sport like basketball and you say, well, you know, LeBron James, uh, he's going to have a scoring title and all that. He's going to score the most points and all that. Yes, because he's playing in a league where it's less physical. So your body will be able to hold up longer. Uh, you will be able to play. Players are playing longer because of the less physicality. And the rules have softened. The rules are more towards offense. So you're going to have, uh, um, you know, a Russell Westbrook running around here getting a thousand triple doubles. Which back in the day, it would have been hard for Russell Wilson, Russell Westbrook to get a, a lot of them triple doubles because of the simple fact that they had real power fours and centers back then. Now you have stretched power fours and stretched centers. They are more out on the perimeter and they are not rebounding as much. You know, back in the day, Russell Russell uh, Westbrook wouldn't have, um, get, he, he wouldn't have averaged 10, 10 rebounds a game because the power fours and the centers would have been grabbing those rebounds. So... That's why it's hard to say, well, is Russell uh, Westbrook better than um, better than guys from back then that um, you know, uh, average triple doubles and and all that? No, he's not because he is playing in a league where he benefits from getting a lot of rebounds, which helps him get a lot of triple doubles. Yeah, Russell Ru Russell Westbrook can play in any era, but not in any era would he average a triple double for a season. I just don't think so. But like like Tom Brady said, this is seven on seven largely. That's why you have a, a quarterbacks like a Patrick Mahomes, quarterback like a Mr. Bitsky can throw six uh, touchdowns in one game. When the last time somebody, when the last time two quarterbacks threw six touchdowns in six touchdowns in one game in the same season? You know what I'm saying? So when you look at stuff like that, and you look at records that have been up for a long time, and then all of a sudden five or six guys in the same year break that record. You have to wonder, like, man, what what's going on? Yeah, it has a lot to do with the rule changes. So a lot of people say, well, Tom Brady is hating on Patrick Mahomes. No, he's not hating on Patrick Mahomes. He's just telling the truth. You know, Patrick Mahomes is a good talent. He's a really good talent. He uh has a, a, a great future ahead of him, you know, uh, barring injury and all that. But uh, I can't say he's better than, um you know, guys that came before him because he didn't play under those stringent rules. So... Like I said, Tom Brady uh, 
he was largely correct. Uh, is he hating? No. I just think a lot of people like to use that hating word when they hear the truth. You know what I'm saying? Because when, when you tell people the truth and they say, oh, you're hating, I don't understand what the word hating means then if I'm telling the truth. So let me know what y'all think. Do, do Tom Brady have a point uh, about, uh, you know, the state of the game? And leave comments, man. Subscribe to the channel. I'm out.